What's up guys, brand new beautiful day here in Ohio. It's a crisp autumn eve. I just got done hitting legs and I'm feeling really good. And I hope you are too and I hope that if you're dealing with something and you're feeling a little bit down, you can know that you're gonna get through it. It's gonna pass over, all right? The storm will pass and it will be a good day. So, look man, we're dudes. We wanna be the beautiful woman one day. Wanna have a beautiful relationship. And how do we do that? Well, they, if you want a girlfriend, you, you should probably realize that you're gonna have to approach. Approaching a girl is going to give you, that's, it's either you get the number or you don't. You get to figure out if this girl that you've been admiring and you find that very attractive is into you or not. And then you can move on. And so there's a lot of guys that say, well, you don't need to worry about what, what you don't need to worry about approaching girls. Be good enough where they come up to you. Now, let me tell you something. I have have enough experience to tell you that it is very rare for a girl to come up to you. And the girls that do come up to you is usually a red flag. There's usually, the one time you will get approached maybe is when you're in the club or when you're out and people have been drinking. I guarantee you though, you're, you're a good looking dude, you look like you're high value, you got your shit together, you're not gonna get approached, cold approach, during the day, very often. It's just how it goes. Don't fucking fool yourself and think that you're gonna wait until Mrs. Wright, the princess, comes up and ask you for your number because you don't fucking feel like doing the work. You're gonna be waiting a long time and you're probably gonna stumble across a girl that, like why, it's just the stigma that you need to approach. And it's, it is literally better this way, all right? It's better. And so this is what's gonna happen. You're gonna understand you gotta get better at approaching. And so what you're gonna look for is the different signals that women are giving out. Now it's nothing complicated, it's nothing crazy, it's not how they wear the hair or the colors that they're wearing. Although when you see a girl you know, wearing paint, probably know something's up um, but what you want to look for is a girl meeting your eyes very simple as this if a girl's looking at you and you constantly see her looking at you this means that you are she's interested we look at stuff that we're curious about stuff that we don't even think about what do we do we don't even look at we don't even acknowledge if you have seen a girl that has met your eyes multiple times and you've been putting off approaching this girl, she's, she's just, you know, beautiful. You'd love to meet her, but you always rationalize to yourself how the time isn't right. Next time, I've done this plenty of times, there's too many people. If she's ever met your eyes a few times, you know, one or twi once or twice, go seal the deal, approach it, get the digits, all right? Very simple too. Like I said, all you, gotta, you don't got to have some crazy game. What you need to have is the mental nuts to go up to her, to just start a conversation, have a little bit of fun, maybe crack a few, you know, it doesn't gotta be so linear where you don't gotta go deep, you don't gotta investigate her life right then and there. You can say, you know, whatever you want. You can just have fun. And then after a minute, I'm gonna go get back to what I'm doing. We should hang out sometime. Get the number, very simple. All right, so the signals that we're looking for is eye contact and maybe a slight smile, okay? There's, there's really nothing else that you need to be told. There's no tricks, there's no tips, there's no knowledge that needs to be said unless it's only about picking up on these signals and then acting on them. Now, if you see a girl and she doesn't pay you any mind, well still, have the fucking balls if you want to and go approach, that way you can figure out, you know you're a man, Take, get, make the moves that you wanna make so that you can get what you wanna get. But I'm telling you that it's, it's gonna be a dead giveaway if a girl's looking at you, smiling, you know, she looks down, looks back up, she's just giving, she's shipping out these signals, approach me, approach me, approach me, and you know what? If you miss out on those signals, the weeks are gonna go by, School's gonna go by. Eventually she starts being with someone else because you never approached. You weren't sure enough. You're never gonna be sure. You're only gonna be sure 
until you have sex with her or you just completely stop talking to her because you got blown out. But every man needs to experience this. Something we must go through. All right, so literally eye contact, very important. Look for the signals, make the approach, bro. And there's, it's nothing crazy. It's nothing that needs to be complicated. All these guys, seven signs that she's into you. Fuck that shit, dude. Are you into her? And then you go on and do it. You go, you just muster up the courage and you go and talk. You don't need any crazy game. Conversate like you would with your little sister or your friends. Just, it's another woman living her life. She's got bills to pay. She's got problems. She's got stress. And we don't realize that, look, you're coming into someone else's life here. When you're trying to, when you're trying to get a girl into, into a relationship or, or meet other people, it's like people have been living their entire life without you at all. So you're saying now your reality would be better if I was inside of that. Well, how do you do that? By being a decent fucking cool dude, being high value. That's why all, we do all the self-development for ourselves. It makes us higher value men. It makes people want to be around us. It makes us better at what we do, our art, our skills. And just be, be, be fun. Give off good vibes. Enjoy being alive. People will pick up on that. People want to be around that. Make people's day better, all right? So I'm telling you, that's really it, man. Nothing complicated. Make the moves. But realize, like, if, if <laughs> people have, have their own lives, and I think it, there's, like, this prevalent narcissistic view that's like, well, we feel so butthurt when someone doesn't want us to be a part of their life. It's like, well, what if, what if you have to even give so their life becomes better? That's a big thing. It's like people already have the reality. People are in their routine. You just are going to put something new into that routine. All right? But look for the signals. Make the approach. That way we can start to move forward now. And we're not just stuck in, oh, this girl's beautiful, but I'm too, I'm too scared to approach. All right? Let's get it. Peace.